It's day 280. Of the 29th year and beyond. Well, it's graduation Friday here in our area. Yeah, a lot of graduations mm -hmm. this weekend. Mm -hmm. And in talking with some friends and family members and whatnot, I was thinking about what happens when um, parents have gone through a divorce or a separation or maybe in a case where the parents were never married and all of a sudden the child says, hey, I want mom or dad who you haven't seen in six months, a year, 10 years, 15 years to come to my graduation celebration. I think um, you have to realize it, regardless of what the relationship is, was, isn't, with you and your previous spouse or you and someone you share a child with if you weren't married <clears throat> you have to heighten your awareness to the fact that this is not about you yes. and uh, it's this is a day of celebration of achievement mm -hmm. for your child right and uh, that's where the focus needs to be and so <clears throat> um, if that's what's going to make the day special for your child then I think uh, uh, that needs to be the priority. I agree. I mean, it's not about you. It's not about your mama, your daddy, your sisters, anybody in the family who may have ill feelings towards this person. It is about your child and the celebration and, like he said, the accomplishments they have made. And so you have to be ready to put those, those things to the side. You know, as a caterer, we've catered some events where um, families had to come together for a child to get married or even in a graduation. And, you know, you have to be really creative sometimes with how you set up the room so that, you know, they can have the different areas where they're not constantly in each other's face. But the bottom line is the celebration is for that child, you know, for what they've done. And so, you know, it's not easy, but sometimes, you know, got to be the best it's person. Necessary. But, you know, you have to ask yourself, <clears throat> how much maturity self-control and discipline mm -hmm. do you have or do you lack mm -hmm. that you can't be uh, in the presence of someone uh, that is uh, very 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 vital in the life of your child for a couple of hours mm -hmm. I mean you know a graduation ceremony is a couple of hours the party would be a few hours I mean could you really not you know I mean think about it you work with people eight hours a day yes. that you may detest. Mm -hmm. So, and, and there is no family connection or anything else. Right. It's the job. Mm -hmm. I mean, if, but my point is, as a mature person, you should be able to put your feelings in check uh, and be able to endure a function, mm -hmm. an event, an activity for some hours for the sake of your child. Yeah. And if they want a picture with their parents. And I don't mean grudgingly. Right. I mean, you should be able to, you know, because this is the thing, and this is one of the things Gail and I talk about all the time. I made up my mind a long time ago, I'm going to enjoy the journey. Anybody else can get glad, mad, or sad. Not my concern. Right. I'm going to enjoy the journey. And, and if you want to take that trip with me, fine. fine. But if you don't want to enjoy the journey, that's fine, too. But you're not going to stop me from enjoying mm -hmm. the journey. And that's my thing. I would be there to celebrate my child if by chance it was Gail and I and we were divorced. Um, I would be there to celebrate and to honor and to uh, lift up my child to mm -hmm. brighten their experience. Right. And so I would be able to deal with Gail regardless of what our relationship was, had been, you know. Again, being able to make the sacrifice for someone you love. That's what love does. That's what it does. And regardless of whether you pay for everything in this child's life. Or nothing. Or nothing. It doesn't matter. It's about what the child wants and what's going to make that day special for them. So, so, enjoy graduation weekend. Particularly those of you who may be thrust together and you don't <laughs> want to be. Make up your mind to He's enjoy smiling. the journey. Until tomorrow, if the Lord says the same. Bye.